videos. Welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be making some marinade for tandoori chicken. I'll be showing you step by step. So let's get started. You can marinate any meat like this, whatever you like. There we go. So we we'll put plain yogurt. I got probably three packets of chicken. Whole yogurt. And this is garlic, but I minced it. So it's garlic. You may need this for 24 hours, 48 hours. Long here, I got it. This is ginger. So I use fresh one. Okay, fresh one tastes more better. That one can like it's already pounded in the store. Fresh. It's not that good, but fresh spices are always good. So we'll add that. This is a tandoori blend you use. If you don't have it, you can mix your own. It's basic red chili powder, grinder, chili powder, and cumin pepper and cayenne pepper. If you don't like hot and spicy, you can just use paprika to buy from any store. See, I use that. Now I'll use just a pinch of chili powder. So, not much because some people don't, can't eat it. They don't, they don't like too spicy. So, you can use cayenne for this to make it right. Some seasoning salt. Seasoning salt is better than salt. Gives it more taste. A little bit more. So I'm using three trays of chicken, and drumsticks, and chicken quarter. Some black pepper in it. Ground black pepper. Mix all this up. Just so. See the color is reddish. It's going more red, you add more seasoning to it, right? Tandoori mix. I'll write it down below what you have to mix to get the tandoori powder blend. So. See the red color? Mm. Last and least, the lemon. Excuse one of these lemons in Wash it. So. If you marinate this for 8 hours, 12 hours, like overnight, you bake it, put in the oven, barbecue it, whatever, it's the best. Just what do you want to see? If you want more red, you can add food coloring or a tandoori mix. See that color? That's what do you want to see?
Make sure you have your hand washed. It's the main part. Move your sleeves up. So, and it's always good to put it on a metal, like this bowl. Don't put it in the plastic. It's not good. I have my chicken cut. This I'm using. I'm using chicken thighs and chicken quarter so, and drumsticks. Make sure you clean up your chicken and cut strips. Don't cut all of it, just cut a little bit. So, dip it. If you wear gloves if you like, but whatever, right? Whatever floats your boat. Make sure you clean the chicken and wash it. Like most people wash it with lemon, it's not good, but it's whatever, man, whatever you like to do. I always wash the chicken before I clean it, clean it, and I wash it. So it's nice. Make sure your chicken is all coated. This is how a tandoori chicken is made. Just do, uh, you see, I cut the drumstick. I didn't cut all of the way. I didn't go all the way down on this. Just, I made a line so the sauce gets in the middle. And I'll be cooking this tomorrow. So. And then, or you could barbecue it if you like, put it in the grill, whatever you like to do. Let me know in the comments what do you guys think. What do you guys want to see next on my channel? It smells great with aroma. Pretty sick. I want to eat it right now, you know? This is the last one. Cover it. So, see the line. You guys are you guys cook this at home? 
like emailing with picture or sharing your pictures with me, see how it turns out. So you know, we'll write it on the bottom so you get see what kind of spices you need. And if you can mix it, you can just buy it. Tell you what you buy. Thank you.